Now at five, banking alert. A skimming device was found on an ATM at a Delaware County Credit Union. Now the search is on for the two men police say are behind the scheme. Wednesday night, the big story on Action News is a warning about the security of your bank account. That device was found at the Franklin Mint Federal Credit Union on McDade Boulevard in Folsom. Action News reporter Walter Perez is there live tonight with the story. Walter. That's right, Rick and Shari. Investigators say it seems the plan was to place that skimmer on that ATM for just a short period of time to keep them from getting caught. But as you'll see, surveillance cameras captured some really clear images of the people responsible. It was last week when Bridley Township police say these two men placed a skimming device on the ATM outside the Franklin Mint Federal Credit Union in Folsom. Investigators say they quickly put the device into place after nightfall and left it there for a few hours before coming back and retrieving the skimmer driving away in a black Hyundai, New Jersey tags E77RTE. We spoke with an official from the credit union who says the customers who use that ATM during that time have already been contacted and their accounts are being monitored as they continue working on ways to keep this from happening again. The networks are trying to do things more. Consumers are trying to do things. So, you know, it's just a combination of a mass effort of everybody involved to, to try to participate and, and uh, keep safe. And Ridley Township Police say this is not an isolated incident. It is going across. We are uh, working with other jurisdictions and other agencies to to try and investigate this. But it, it's not just happening in Ridley Township. It's happening in other uh, locations as well. Just last week, Action News reported how a skimming device was found attached to an ATM inside the Wawa on Lincoln Highway in Callan Township, Chester County. That device at least appeared to be equipped with Bluetooth capabilities that possibly transmitted account information to the people responsible. That skimming device has since been removed, but so far, no arrests have been made. Now at this point, no indication these two cases might be linked, but investigators do say they're looking into that possibility. Once again, no arrests in either case so far. Anyone with information is asked to contact police. Reporting live from Folsom, Walter Perez, Channel 6, Action News. Rick?